Hundreds of balloonists and hundreds of thousand eager spectators converge on this grassy 80-acre field to be part of the largest ballooning event in the world. And each morning, the question is still the same. Will the balloons take off or not? Basically, clear skies and light winds will do the trick. And not only do the winds have to be light at the surface, but so do the winds just above the surface because balloons fly with the wind. So when it comes to landing a balloon, strong winds can lead to some very rough landings, and no one wants that. So what keeps you from seeing these massive aircraft take flight? Most are pretty obvious, showers and thunderstorms, sleet and snow. Yes, it has actually snowed in past balloon fiestas. Low visibility due to overcast skies or fog, and heavy rain can produce widespread ponding on the launch site, which has been known to keep balloonists and their vehicles off the field. But the biggest weather element creating the most problem is wind. It has to be lower than 11.5 miles an hour. Special shapes are typically more in the uh, you know five to seven knot range, I would say. So you're looking, you know five to seven, eight miles an hour tops for, for any of the special shapes to go. We're trying to make the best safe decision for the pilots. The Fiesta has a team of expert meteorologists taking wind readings and studying atmospheric conditions across the area. That information is given to the balloon officials to help determine if an event is a go or no go. We've got skydivers, we've got fireworks, we've got bands performing. There's so many different things. And so given that that's the case, you know, um, we will make adjustments to any of those if the weather conditions change our, our operation. The Albuquerque International Balloon Fiesta is now in its 50th year, and with it a long history of successful flying events and balloon glows, which among other things have made it the most photographed event in the world. The visual signal for balloonists and spectators to know if the conditions are good enough to fly is a flagpole. It's a color-coded system where green gives pilots the green light and the balloons can fly. Yellow means stand by and the red flag means conditions are just not safe.